14 year old Detroit boy sent away after confessing to killing four people in 2007 is set to be free. Wayne County prosecutor Kim Worthy made the call late this afternoon. That's right, Devin. Her decision comes after an internal investigation in the case of Devante Sanford revealed holes in police testimony. She's calling for Sanford, who is now 23, to be released from prison as soon as possible. Now, of course, there are a lot of moving parts here. Let's get right to our Mara McDonald. She's at Frank Murphy Hall of Justice tonight. Now, Mara, when Sanford was 14, he confessed to this crime. Do we know why? He sure did, Carmen, and here's the thing. He was 14, but he was also illiterate, learning disabled, and blind in one eye. Can a 14-year-old with that set of circumstances really confess or plead to anything? And now, after a months-long investigation, Kim Worthy says he needs to be released from prison. Four people found murdered in what police described as a known drug house on Runyon Street back in 07. The story led all the newscasts that day. Later, Detroit police would finger a then 14-year-old Devontae Sanford for the crime. Sanford confessed to the killings, but his mother and his legal team have said all along he was in no way mentally capable to admit to anything. Add to the mix convicted hitman Vincent Smothers, who admitted to police back in 07 he was responsible for the four murders on Runyon Street and has said on multiple occasions that Devante had nothing to do with it. Now, nine years later, after a team of lawyers from Dykema Gossett took on Sanford's case along with the U of M Innocence Project and pushed to have him released, it's happening. Sanford's legal team put on enough pressure that Worthy had the Michigan State Police do an investigation that's taken months, but at the end of the day, concludes Sanford needs to be released. He wrote his mom just started crying. Um, he's very, very happy and just looking forward to having him. Back here live, Kim Worthy is calling a press conference for Thursday morning to talk about the internal investigation and to go over that report's findings. Carmen Devon, back to you. So where is Devante now, Mara? Do we know? We do. He's in a prison up in the UP, Carmen, and the order that was signed today says he needs to be released immediately. So let's see how fast immediately is. Back uh -huh. to you. We'll stay on top of it. Mara McDonald.